Introduction Welcome to this informative video on Droxidopa, a medication used to treat neurogenic orthostatic hypotension. In this video, we will explore its history, mechanism of action, medical uses, pharmacokinetics, efficacy, and more. Let's begin. History of Droxidopa The development of Droxidopa dates back to the 1980s, when it was first synthesized in Japan as a potential treatment for hypertension and orthostatic hypotension. In the 1990s, clinical trials were conducted to assess its safety and efficacy. By 2007, the US FDA granted it orphan drug designation for treating neurogenic orthostatic hypotension, or NOH. However, in 2012, the FDA initially rejected its application due to concerns over efficacy. A year later, Chelsea Therapeutics resubmitted the application, and in 2014, the FDA finally approved Droxidopa, which is marketed under the brand name Northera. Introduction to Droxidopa Droxidopa is primarily used to treat symptoms of lightheadedness, dizziness, and fainting in patients with conditions like Parkinson's disease. Chemical Structure and Properties Droxidopa is structurally similar to L-DOPA with an additional hydroxyl group. It has a molecular weight of 213.19 and a formula of C9H11NO5. It is slightly water-soluble and is used in its L-isoform, which converts into norepinephrine in the body. Mechanism of Action Droxidopa crosses the blood-brain barrier and is converted into norepinephrine by L-aromatic amino acid decarboxylase, AAAD. Norepinephrine acts on alpha-adrenergic receptors to increase blood pressure and on beta-adrenergic receptors to stimulate the heart. This process helps counteract the symptoms of neurogenic orthostatic hypotension. Medical uses. Droxidopa is used for conditions such as neurogenic orthostatic hypotension, NOH, caused by Parkinson's disease, multiple system atrophy, pure autonomic failure, dopamine beta hydroxylase deficiency, non diabetic autonomic neuropathy. Pharmacokinetic. Droxidopa's effectiveness depends on how it is absorbed, distributed, metabolized, and excreted. Absorption. 90% bioavailability. Peak levels occur within 1 to 4 hours after dosing. Distribution. It accumulates primarily in the liver and kidneys, with some crossing the blood-brain barrier. Metabolism. Droxidopa undergoes metabolism via catecholamine pathways. Excretion. Around 75% of the drug is eliminated via the urine within 24 hours. Pharmacodynamics Droxidopa has an elimination half-life of 2.5 hours and must be taken every 4 hours during the day. Its presser effect peaks around 3 to 4 hours after dosing and lasts 6 hours. It has minimal impact on heart rate, whether the patient is standing or lying down. Therapeutic uses Droxidopa is primarily used for treating neurogenic orthostatic hypotension associated with Parkinson's disease, multiple system atrophy, and familial amyloid polyneuropathy, managing symptoms like dizziness and fall risks, being explored for use in neurological disorders and blood-related conditions. Adverse effects. Like any medication, Droxidopa can have side effects, including headache, dizziness, nausea, Fatigue, insomnia, anxiety, constipation. Efficacy and clinical studies. Clinical trials have shown droxidopa to be effective in treating orthostatic hypotension. Studies indicate it works well across various populations, but may be more effective in some groups depending on their comorbidities. 
Alternatives to droxidopa. Other treatments for orthostatic hypotension include midodrine, fludrocortisone, non-pharmacological interventions like increasing fluid intake, and compression stockings. Droxidopa is preferred when patients do not respond well to other medications. Patient experiences. Patients using droxidopa report improved blood pressure regulation, reduction in dizziness and fainting episodes. Some patients, however, experience mild side effects. Dosage and administration. Initial dose, 100 milligrams three times daily, 300 milligrams per day. Incremental increase can be adjusted by 100 milligrams per dose every 24 to 48 hours based on patient response. Maximum dose, 600 milligrams three times daily, 1,800 milligrams per day. Should be taken orally with or without food. Tablets should not be crushed or chewed. Drug interactions, droxidopa, interacts with several medications, including abacavir, may increase serum levels of droxidopa. Isobutylol, may increase its therapeutic effect. NSAIDs like aceclofenac and isomedicine may increase blood pressure. Acetaminophen may reduce droxidopa's excretion rate. Toxicity and safety. Droxidopa has minimal toxic effects, with an oral LD50 of more than 5 grams per kilogram in animal studies. Side effects occur in only 0.78% of patients. Common adverse effects include nausea, headaches, and increased blood pressure. Conclusion Droxidopa, marketed as Northera, is a valuable treatment for neurogenic orthostatic hypotension, NOH. It works by increasing norepinephrine levels to help regulate blood pressure. Clinical trials support its effectiveness in reducing dizziness, fainting, and blood pressure instability. However, patients should be aware of possible side effects and drug interactions. Overall, droxidopa remains an important option for managing NOH and improving quality of life for many patients. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please like, share, and subscribe for more medical insights.